hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here welcome and if you're returning a returning viewer thank you and stay tuned for even more videos like this so this week i am cleaning my living room i haven't cleaned it in about like deep cleaned it in about two weeks so it's been quite messy and i didn't like how it looked so i decided to clean it join me and i hope you enjoy this video so i first have to open the windows to just let fresh air get in and uh, yeah you know okay this house this particular house doesn't get stuffy but before cleaning i try to yeah i make sure not try to i make sure i open the windows and uh, i don't move furniture around because it weakens furniture so that's why i i recommend cleaning uh, at least deep cleaning that you have to move furniture around at least once or twice a month if you have to moving furniture around tends to weaken it so yeah this carpet was a bit dusty so i'm taking it outside to air it during the time i'm cleaning air and dust it and just try and uh, what is it called remove some dust on it yeah since i still don't have an a vacuum cleaner i intend i'm planning on getting one soon very soon manifesting okay so yeah now that that's done let's hang up the curtains so that the water doesn't get onto them while i'm cleaning because i like to at least wet the floor i don't like dry mopping i it, it actually in fact people who dry mop irritate me so yeah You shut out them quickly, I let you It's easy how the fighting, but I know I give you everything I am You throw it away like it's nothing It's easy how Let's wet the floor first before we start mopping, yeah, so yeah Pouring some water and then clean, clean, clean. A few of my son's toys are all. His toys are always on the other place. That I ha I cannot. I I do not have a way of controlling that. In a shindoa. So when mopping I try to clean the tile what are they called edges yeah uh, the ones just close to the wall yeah because you'll notice like if if you haven't cleaned your house in a while just check you'll notice they get quite dusty and it can look quite awful for okay if if you sit and just look at it when you're seated in your living room and especially for people who like you have bright colored walls say this cream white it is very easily noticeable yeah so i suggest you clean it while you're mopping or clean it with a a, a, a small cloth yeah Try to reach you, baby. To 
I forgot to mention for my mopping water I use uh, a bit of detol uh, some washing powder and just a teensy bit of chick I try to mix it up because it's like you know kids and Reese might drop something on the floor and pick it up maybe food and I try to make sure the floor is sanitary or sanitized in a way not okay if you can't eat off the floor but it's at least safe for when he drops something yeah Let's push back the chairs and put them back in their place. I was listening to some Saudi Soul music, the Midnight Train album, an all time favorite of mine while cleaning. Uh, but then I can't play the audio because copyright and all. We respect other artists. Okay, now I know the buckets come with the ringer and I do not like to use it if I'm being honest. I don't like using it. So I'll just ring the duster using my hands. Yeah, I find it easier. And I get a well ring duster after that instead of using the bucket ringer and having blisters because of the wood. For a 
second I forgot I had not put the carpet back on the floor and I put back the TV stand oh don't worry I'm not pushing it on the floor it actually has wheels so I'm not like dragging it on the floor it has wheels so it's actually easy to push it so let's put back the carpet and yeah finish up with the living room let's push it out because the carpet doesn't fit with the tv stand over there it's supposed to be on top of the carpet so yeah let's push the seats and place the carpet straight Uh, let's put back the cushions, the backrests. I like to like uh, make that car depression in the middle so that it brings out uh, that car, that what do I say, it? triangular look, sort of. And I like it that I don't like them looking all square and basic. Yeah. So let's clean the TV stand. I just used warm water with a bit of soap yeah and uh, for the gift bag you see that i have my tiny appliances like my iron box my blow dryer my cables i'll find a way of making them look decent but that does not look decent at all so yeah Uh, putting the curtain straight and uh, I'll show you this is the final look this is what the living room looks like at the moment before the makeover so stay tuned and uh, like share and subscribe thank you so much for watching and see you next week bye